Hey everybody, Dr. JG Levine I want to share a tip for you today. When somebody quits, oftentimes in this industry, they typically don't point the finger at themselves for the reason why they're quitting. In fact, one common reason why people say they're quitting is because they hadn't heard from their enroller or their upline. So for that reason, as well as to do the right thing, you're going to want to communicate with your team on a regular basis. And I would submit to you that people, especially that you personally enrolled or sponsored, you have that responsibility to them, you're going to want to call them on a regular basis. Now, it's a two-way street. They've got to call you as well, and they've got to bring leads and so you can help them with their leads and so on and so forth. But the concern then is, well, gosh, I don't know what to say if I call somebody on my team. Here's a technique that you can do, and actually this is to help you, their business, your business, and everybody's business. You're going to first want to look in your back office at people who are inactive, people who haven't ordered in a while. And listen, there's might not mean that they quit. Things get in the way. Life gets in the way. Things change. And you're going to want a reason to call these people and reach out to them to see how they're doing. And above and beyond seeing how they're doing, something that you're going to want to share with them with urgency or some great things that are occurring in the company that they might not be aware of because they're unplugged. They haven't ordered in a while. They haven't been on the team calls or the company calls or a defense. So they might not be aware of it. So in your back office, you know, around the Green Tree Report area, we've got a lot of different areas you can look there. You can look at not only your personally enrolled, but pretty much anybody on your team to see when they've ordered last. And if they haven't ordered in a while and you know the people, this might be a good time for you to reach out to them. And I think a great time to do this is on a Thursday or a Wednesday because our commission week ends on Thursdays. So you don't have to do this every Thursday, but this is something you're going to want to put in your event uh, as a recurring event on your calendar. Maybe do this once a month. And you don't have to call the same people over and over again. You're going to want to keep a record of who you called, when the last time you spoke to them. But reach out to constantly new people on your team, whether you enroll them or you're connected with them in some way, shape, or form. So now the reason to call. Right now, it's Thursday. It's the end of the commission week. So with urgency, you're watching this video, you still have time to call some people on your team and share the sale that we've got going on now. We've got a sale of 16 different sales going on right now, and it's going to literally end this Sunday. And they're going to appreciate that you're sharing that with them because they're not plugged in, if they're not reading the emails, if they're not on social media, if they haven't been on the team calls and so on and so forth, they might not be aware of it. Maybe they haven't ordered in two, three, four, five months. So you sharing those sales with them is an awesome way to reconnect, get the conversation going, see how you can help them, see if they have any prospects that they haven't called in a few months. Maybe they can get them on the phone with you, do a three-way call and so on and so forth. It's not just sales, that we've got these great 16 sales that are going on. You can talk to them about current promotions or contests that are going on or events that are coming up for you and your team or webinars or the Great Green event. So these are just some different things that you can do, but it all starts with a phone call. Today, I just find it's so hard for some people to just pick up the phone call. But people want that contact. So pick up the phone, call some people, even if it's just two or three people today. Go ahead and do that. And what I'd love to know is some of the results you've gotten down. Just go ahead and write on the comment section some results. Somebody that you haven't spoken to in three, four, five, six months or more, and you reached out to them because of this video, and now they're going to get active again, or they really appreciate that you shared the sales because we've got some great sales, or maybe you share the new exciting Reds formula that we've got going on now with the organic Moringa. So I'd like for you in the comments down below to share some of the results you had by doing this and teaching your team to do this as well. And as always, I look forward to sharing with you again real soon. Bye-bye, everybody.